lace front wear what lace front wear <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome to or back to my channel. It's Sarah Elizabeth here and I'm back with another video. So as you saw by the title, this is going to be a wig review. I am so excited for this review. <laughs> this is my first wig ever and I have so many good things to say about it. And I have a few cons, but but I'm about to give y'all all the tea on it, which is why y'all probably clicked this video. So with that being said, be sure to give this video a like. Comment down below how you feel about this wig and your thoughts on it and if you have it share your opinions down below as well that would be lovely and be sure to subscribe of course i probably have a lot of new viewers on this video because you guys want to see the review on it so be sure to subscribe while you're here because it means the world to me so with that being said let's get on into this video okay so as i said before this is my very first wig and literally i love it <laughs> i really love it it took a minute for me uh for it to grow on me but honestly this is like the best wig and it was so affordable it cost me only 40 dollars 40 dollars plus shipping of course but um yeah i'll have it all linked down below where i ordered it from so you guys can get you one as well but this is the package that it came in like so the regular package that wigs all come in this is a bobby boss wig and it is the style yara i think i'm saying that right in the color one honestly i wish i would have gotten a 1b just so it could look more natural but in all honesty this color is growing on me so i'm not too upset about it anymore as i first was i was like no this is too dark i can't wear this or whatever i feel like i could definitely wear this out at night time, at the clubs, turn up, <laughs> JK, I don't go to clubs, but anyway, it also came with this little post-it note uh, tied on to the hair, and it's just telling you the details about the hair, basically, it's telling you the color again, the type, everything you ordered, so you can put heat on this hair, I haven't put on any heat yet, I think I will straighten it to get a little bit of the kinkiness out but probably nothing too major so yeah that also came on there um honestly honestly i feel like i look like <laughs> that girl off of i guess it's a chick off of the incredibles and <laughs> i don't know i love it i like it uh here's a side view as you can see and here's the other side view this side is a little choppy. I don't like that about it, but it's nothing too major, nothing I can't fix myself. So yeah. I am going to go ahead and give you guys the pros as well as the, as well as the cons, but we'll start off with the pros because <laughs> honestly, what? So the first pro is I love the way it moves. It's not stiff, It's like it moves with your body, so you don't have to worry about it sticking and being stiff and like you know when you look down it's like sticking up you don't have to worry about that <laughs> honestly so i love the way it flows um another pro is the cap the cap fits so well that i was surprised i literally didn't have to adjust it at all although i could make it a little bit tighter but i just didn't want to i like the way it fits like this um i also didn't have to glue it down it has its straps in the it has straps in the cap as well as a comb hook on the back so it's pretty secure i don't feel like you need to glue it down or anything but if you just want that extra secureness go ahead um another pro is the part i love the part i love the middle part i've been loving middle parts on me for so long now i used to always do side parts but middle parts are just my thing now so this is already pre-plucked. I didn't have to do any extra plucking, although I think that I might because I think it could look a little bit more natural than what it's looking right now. But honestly, again, if you're a first time wig wearer like myself, it's already plucked enough. You don't have to do any extra plucking if you don't feel comfortable with doing it. Don't. Like I stated before, the color, I love the color now. Like this jet black, I like it. I like it. I just want to order all the colors now. <laughs> they have so many colors to choose from, so 
don't think jet black is the only color but honestly I think I'm gonna go back and buy all the colors because they have plenty so yeah I think that's all the pros that I have I mean it speaks for itself as you can see it looks so like natural movable blah 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 of course it's a synthetic weave so I don't think it'll last that long but I do hope it lasts long so let's move on to the cons which I only have like two cons really um, a con with the first con is that it does get a little bit um, tangled at the only at the ends of the hair I don't know why that is but like only at the end of the hair so let me try to comb it for you guys okay I'm gonna comb it for you guys I don't know if it's nappy right now I just combed through it but it gets like hard to comb through as you get to the bottom of the hair I don't know why that is <laughs> I guess I don't know I don't know why that is but it does get nappy at the end and another con would be while I'm doing this um, you can see the choppiness like right there that it has on this side but like I said not too too bad but yeah and then the second con is that oh my god this hair sheds I'm not lying like this hair sheds and it when it sheds it sheds so I don't know why that is I guess they don't I guess you don't they don't tie it tight enough I don't know if you know why shedding occurs let me know down below so I can know in the future but yeah it does shed I can't lie to you guys it sheds <laughs> but I mean it's so pretty that I don't even mind it so and then one more con is that it comes with a few baby hairs literally a few like three strands <laughs> so I kind of just mixed mine in with my baby hairs mixed the wigs with my baby hairs and made it into a little scoop um, but uh, you can honestly make your own baby hairs with the wig itself I just don't know how to do that I don't want to mess up the wig so I won't even try it but yeah honestly I love this wig this wig was made for me you know <laughs> I'm so glad I purchased it I did so many um, so much research on this wig and like reviews on it before I bought it so make sure you do that too you know don't just rely on one review but honestly honestly I'm not lying when I say this wig is the bomb for first time wig wearers like myself um I think that's all of the information I have for you guys if I didn't touch something and you guys really want to know just let me know down below ask me the question uh, I will respond I respond pretty quickly because I do get notifications from my YouTube channel so don't be afraid to ask I'll be here to answer the questions for you I hope I covered everything and I hope you guys enjoyed this video hopefully I wasn't touching my hair too much <laughs> I probably was but yes if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video bye beauties